Hey guys, how's it going? I have a life-changing iPhone trick that I just figured out how to do and I need to share it with you. Do you ever have need for your iPhone to read the screen to you? I commonly do. I'll finish my coffee in the morning just before going to work and I'll get halfway through reading something on my phone. So I get into the truck and I reach down before I leave my driveway, of course. I reach down and I grab my phone and I pick it up and I mash the button and I say, Siri, read the page or something to that effect, trying to guess the magic words. And it always goes something like this. I'm sorry, Guido, I didn't get that. What do you mean you didn't get that? Yes, yes, my phone calls me Guido. I have my beautiful and talented daughter to thank for that one. At any rate, it never reads the page to me. And it just makes me crazy because I know that there's something built in there. On the flip side of this story, occasionally, in the middle of the night, as I'm sitting in the living room editing video, somehow something happens, there's some sort of gesture, a, a finger swipe or something that I do, that my phone just immediately starts reading at full volume. And it scares the water out of me, wakes up everybody else in the house, and I'm left trying to figure out what the heck just happened. Well, I finally figured it out, and here's how you do it. First things first, this is an iOS 8.0 or later feature. So I imagine that on your iPad that's iOS 8.0 or later, that this works the same way. I don't have an iPad with iOS 8.0 or later, so I couldn't test it personally. But if your iPhone has got that update, iOS 8.0 or later, this feature is in there. So here's how to get to it. Go to Settings, now select General, from there go to Accessibility, and go right here to Speech. Okay, so you have two, three selections here. Go to the middle one, Speak Screen, and just toggle it on. Now it's enabled. So the way that it works is it's a two finger down swipe. So you need to put your two fingers at the top of your screen and swipe down. Now when you're halfway down the road and you need to finish reading whatever you're reading, two fingers. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer, the slings and arrows of And you can speed it up. Fortune, fortune, or to take arms against a sea of Or slow it down. And, by them, and to, to make it shut up. No more. And just click the little X. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, like I said, I found it to be kind of a game changer. Now I catch myself just trying to find an article before I leave the house so I can tee it up and have my phone reading to me while I'm on my way to work. Please use your newfound powers for good, not evil. Don't be surfing the web while you're driving down the road just looking for something for your phone to read to you. Do it while you're stopped, please. And that's about it for the iPhone trick. So since that's not very much material, I want to give you a quick kind of uh, channel update to let you know what's going on around here. First things first, the channel naming process. I feel like we're getting, we're getting closer. We're kind of narrowing it down. I have uh, a hot list of about six or eight that I'm kind of tossing around and adding to and subtracting from. I hope to have that process finished in the next week or I don't know, maybe two weeks. I want to do it right this time so I don't have to ever redo it again. I've got lots of projects and stuff going on in the workshop. Uh, I've got the saw that um, I just, just posted the third installation a couple of days ago. Maybe this morning, I guess I posted it, depending on when you're watching this. Um, the only thing left to do on the saw is to sharpen it. I'm still studying up a little bit to make sure that I can that I'm competent at, um, at changing the teeth before I get crazy on that. Um, I have another axe project coming up that I've already started on. I'm, I'm nearing the end of the first video so that I can put it up. Um, well, do you want to see it? Yeah. Yeah, you do. Check it out. There you go. That's all you get. You're going to have to watch the video. You're going to have to wait for it and then watch it when it comes out. But you're going to like it. It's pretty sweet. And it's a big change. We'll just say that. It's a big change from where it started. And the other thing that's kind of hot, uh, hot on the topic right now is I was just replying to another 
uh, comment earlier this evening and I had made, made mention of sharing. Shares beget views and views beget shares and all that stuff begets subscribers. I don't know where I came up with the word begets, but it's the word of the hour. At any rate, the biggest thing that you can help out with on this channel is to share a video. Go back through, find a video. There's surely, if you've watched more than a couple of them, there's one that's your favorite or, yeah, one that's your favorite. If you find something cool, share it. Because if you share it, somebody else is going to share it and they're going to share it and pretty soon everybody will know how to do this trick on the iPhone and it'll be awesome. So that's, that's about it. That's all I've got. I appreciate you getting this far and... Um, Click the thumbs up if you like this video. Go ahead and do it. Click that thumbs down if you didn't like the video, but please tell me why you didn't if you didn't like it. And share this video if you found it useful. I appreciate your time. We'll see you on the next video.